You know, Chill, I am always impressed with what this area has to offer. Like, look at Bucks County. Like, mm -hmm. it's, it's so close, but it's like a whole new world when you get out here. And I'll tell you what, there are some great beers being made out here with some really cool places making them. For sure. We were the bootstrappiest of bootstrap startups. Sort of like Humber or Start, we literally started in a basement with self-distribution and the first beer was actually sold down the street at the Perk, which you can almost hit with a stone from here. Perkasy is a, a nice small little town in the central Upper Bucks area. We're not too far from Philly, we're also reasonably close to New York. Less than 10,000 people. Uh, it's got a lot of history. We want people to want to be here for the sake of how they feel here. Having the really great beer in hand is sort of a bonus. What really makes us a little unique in Pennsylvania is that we have a very, very large barrel aged sour program. Several hundred oak casks varying in size from 50 gallons to 1500 gallons. But across the board, you can find barrel aged sours, kettle sours, fruit sours, lagers, IPA, hazy IPA, West Coast IPA. I don't really typecast this brewery into one thing or the other. We like being every person's brewery. Did you know they do sour sundays? Nah, you know I'm about my sours. I know you are. We'll add it to the list. And there's another spot that I'm gonna show you in Bucks County that's like truly a family affair. Oh, I'm excited. The property we're on right now was part of the Durham Mill. My dad uh, bought it in 1973 and it's been a working farm in our family ever since then. So we kept it as a working farm. We, we did not want to give up that aspect of it and actually bring in that forgotten craft of true farm to glass, farm to table. Each and every beer begins in the field. We're actually taking it from planting it, growing it, harvesting it, malting it, and then making a product out of it and getting it out there in the public. I think there's a lot of satisfaction that yeah. comes from this hard work. You can visit us on special events that we do once a month here at the barn. The full beer experience you can get at our tap room in New Hope, Pennsylvania. It is a lovely town, also packed with history. It is a complete opposite of the city life, the high energy, hustle and bustle. Here you come to unwind and you just explore and relax and go back to your life rejuvenated, hopefully. That is wild. I guess that's what farm to tap stands for, right? True I mean, definition of local. There you uh -huh. go. If you're looking for another cool spot, real Northeast Philly experience, Broken Goblet. All right, you know. You know about those guys. Broken Goblet was born in a recording studio. So whatever we do, it's got to be focused on music. Music has to be sort of woven through it. When you come here, the first thing you're gonna notice is this giant stage that we have, which came from the electric factory, actually. You're going to expect to have lots of live music here, and that's one of the things that we do as much as we possibly can. So you can expect a big patio, we've got a lower beer garden, we're in the process of a music pavilion, it's out front, there's gonna be something for everybody. We've always been a brewery that did not care to follow the trends. That being said, if you don't have several IPAs, super accessible, you're, you're not going to survive. So, of course, we've transitioned to that, but not like other spaces have. So we still like to focus on our dark beers. The variety that we offer is what I think sets us apart. We're easy to find. We're a straight shot up 95 from Philadelphia, two turns off the exit, and you find us. Big obnoxious sign outside, so you really can't miss us. Chill, do you know that stage in there? It is the actual stage that David Bowie performed on no in the Electric Factory. I've stood on it. It has magical powers, nah, I swear. It's dope. They, they lend themselves to a lot of collaboration. Like, they got something special for, for the hungry dogs. I'm pretty sure I know what you're talking about. And I'm just going to say that everyone does like it, and we do care. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. The Craft Beer Trail of Greater Philadelphia. Five counties, over 90 breweries, and over 1,000 beers. Sip your way through it, one beer at a time. <laughs>